All right, here we go. Final stage at, I almost said Michigan. Why did you say, whoa, it's, it's kind of common to see that. Like, all these, like, whatever, why it's at Phoenix, it's kind of, it's kind of, like, uh, common these days. So as you, so as you can tell, I'm rooting for both the track house cars. Both of them are inside the top ten, which is a good thing, very good thing. With, uh, Dan with, uh, them rounding out the top ten, actually. It's hard to write because I actually have a lead, but Chase Elliott's going to have the crowd cheering if he takes the lead. Yeah, by the way, I just heard Jeff Warren's coming back from the next three. Maybe it was Jeff Burden. Yeah. I think, uh, Jeff... For yeah, Jeff Gordon is coming back for the next race at, uh, hold up, it might be, I don't, it's not Richmond, it's not Richmond, it's definitely not a super speedway, it might be Atlanta or Circuit of the Americas, Atlanta, so the next race is at Atlanta, and I think Jeff Gordon's going to be there, but what about Circuit of the Americas, 115, yeah, that's a lot. Well, at least for me, because um, I, I'm not really the biggest fan of this. This is a mile track, and I, I'm just not the biggest fan of these types of tracks where they're like, has like 500 laps. My joy, call it Trackhouse Racing, not Team Trackhouse, you weirdo. Okay, I, I, I was a little bit mean, sorry. <laughs> I did not know what I was doing then. Alright, so um, Dano Suarez did not do good the first two stages, and he's rounding up the top ten. He's in ninth. Uh, tenth. Because uh, Ross Chastain just passed him. Also, fun fact, Ross Chastain's uh, K1 speed scheme is actually the same scheme that Daniel Suarez was supposed to drive. But then came to the world, bought out the races where he was supposed to run, pump it up, uh, where pump it up, K1 speed, and some other sponsors. So we never saw the K1 speed out on track, the K1 speed car out on track until just now. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I won't really embark to jump on the point standings, honestly. I, I really need him to jump the point. Yeah, he needs to jump with the points. He's not doing good in the points battle, like, at all. At least as of now. Yeah, and, uh, I don't want to say any more names. I don't want to jinx anybody, but Je Black Flax Matter doesn't want to jinx anybody anymore. Title, last car on the lead lap, 22 cars. First car lap down is, I think, Justin Haley. At least I think it's Justin Haley. He's still going strong. He's trying to do something. Also, uh, Austin Cigarette, he left the points for the first two weeks, actually. First rookie in NASCAR history to do something like that first. It's, like, so easy for rookies in the truck in the Xfinity series, but not at all the Cup series. Like, why, though? It has to be Daniel Suarez, or like the... Yeah, he's a, he's really talented, so... Um, yeah, Daniel's a really talented race car driver, so... I, I would hate to see him be bad. Like, below top 30. Like, cause um... Like, the trackhouse cars have run so good this year. Like, the first race, the Daytona 500, Daniel Suarez finished the lead lap. The first time he's done so in the Daytona 500. And then he, uh... Finished... Fourth at Auto Club after leading a bit of that final restart, and I was super excited about that. Crashed the next week at uh, Las Vegas, and commercial break. Dang it! Oh no! Yeah, Cliff Warrior must love going first. So I wonder how. Uh, yeah, so uh, I wonder who's going to be in the booth. I, yeah, I don't know who's going to be in the booth with uh, Clint and Jeff. I'm not sure if it's going to be Mike Joy or maybe someone else. <laughs> Did you see Clint? He, like, turned and over to Larry McReynolds. That's actually really funny. That's hilarious, dude. Alright. First race. Then I get back to Yeah. Former teammates as well. Yeah, they were former teammates as well, so. Um, 46, that's a lot. And Regan doesn't, oh, never mind. I was about to say Regan doesn't have a camera. Um, I just wonder why they had to be so loud down there and not 
and not loud up there. Not loud up there in the booth, but super loud in uh, the track because of all the cars. Um, wants to watch. James. Ninety-six. Started second. Is now eighteen. What happened to Denny Hamlin? He was at, like, how is he outside the top ten? Like so far in like the first few stages. The first two stages, actually. Oh, Martin Truex! Oh no! I think it was Danica. Nice job, jinxing at our driver. Yeah, so, um, where's... Wait, what happened to Daniel Suarez? Maybe it's a glitch in the system. Oh, he got penalized. Yeah. That's like the third time this season that Daniel Suarez has gotten penalized. Ah, oh, come on. I knew it. It was a penalty for speeding. Um, oh, there's Harrison. What's happened to him? Oh, no. Oh no! That's really frustrating. He's shaking his head. I was like, he wiggled. So I think Harrison Burton is not having the best time of his life today. Definitely not having the best time of his life. And there's a big fight for a position right there. So Daniel Swartz is going to try. He's past Busher. Is that Busher? No, that's Austin Sindri. No, that's not. No, that's not Cinder. He has to get by uh, Eric Jones and now Chris Buescher for uh, 16th. Oh no! He they actually did that. I just realized. Oh no! I remember that. Yeah. Yeah, Daniels. Not Daniel Suarez. Alex Bowman is going to be a future Hall of Famer. Just watch him get inducted into the NASCAR Hall of Fame with all that. This is actually hilarious, dude. That is just so funny. Like, like it's not funny that uh, Alex Bowman is not a hack or he's just lucky. Like he, uh, he's a he's a great driver. It's just so funny that he's having these shirts. Like he's like Alex Bowman is going to be a future Hall of Famer. Just watch. Okay, sorry. Yeah, but Alex Bowman is 10th. That's all. That's what I'm gonna end on, at least for now. Chase Elliott, no, not Chase Briscoe could actually win this one. Let's hope. Uh, I, I think I can see. Uh, yeah, Daniel Suarez is about to get laughed. Chase Briscoe, Chase Elliott, four tenths of a second apart. That's what it looks like. Yeah. Wait. Yeah, Gillen's about to go lap down. Is that Gillen right there? Justin Haley, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Daniel Suarez got penalized. I just wish he did not. Three times this year he's been penalized, but he can do some pretty good drives, honestly. I really hope there's caution. I don't want it to just be like a boring rest of the race go screen moment and Chase Briscoe wins the race. Like, I would like Chase Briscoe. Yeah, it would be pretty cool to see Chase Briscoe win the race, but I don't want it to be like... I don't want it to be like the, the last 20, the last 29 laps, caution free. I, I don't want that. But that's just the me thing. Come on, Elmer World, get top 10, baby. Same might be the day. Just imagine if he gets jinxed. Oh, there's gonna be a crash. That's a caution. How is he gonna be able to get back, or does he have to hit the wall? That is not good for Chase Briscoe. <laughs> I just jinxed him! I literally just jinxed him. I just jinxed him by saying that there was going to be caution and Eric Jones brings out the caution. Wow. Yeah, Chastain. Chastain. I really hope he gets out of front. This is like not like the big race. Like, I think we're going to have 22 laps to go uh, when we come back racing. Because it, it, it did just turn to 24. Show the race off pit road. Come on, guys. Come on, Fog. Show the race off pit road. So, um, yeah, Chase Briscoe's going to win the race off pit road. Let's hope, uh, uh, yeah, so, um, I don't think Daniel Suarez can make this good, this much ground in 20 laps, so I think Ross Chastain can do something good. 
Tyler Reddick's also going to be there. Yeah, Tyler Reddick's going to do something. Oh, here comes Ross Chastain. Here comes Chastain. How did he live through that? Oh, Chastain's going to try and get by him. I, I didn't see it. I was focusing on Daniel Suarez. Oh! Big battle. Here it comes. Here's the battle for first. 19 to go. Yeah. What's happening? They're all going nuts. Oh! That's a wiggle. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of work for Tyler Wright to do if he wants to get inside the top five. Or top two. Mm. Oh, no. Yeah. Three wide for... Three wide for the lead. Um... Chase Briscoe might actually win this race right here. Yeah. Oh no. Bump and run? That might be a bump and run for Ross Chastain right there. Where's where's Eric on roll in the point standing? Where's Chase Briscoe and then Eric on roll in points? No, no, I'm looking at the latest leaderboard. Here it comes. Well, Ross has seems about to get passed by Kevin Harvick. Dang it, but Chase Briscoe is 14. I think that uh Eric that he might jump over Eric on roll for the highest Stuart Haas car. Well, this I think. Oh no! Oh no! Yeah, indeed, indeed, indeed. All right, so uh, yeah, Daniel Suarez is still 14th. I think he could actually get the top 10, but I highly doubt about the top five for a win. Not for the win. I do not think Daniel Suarez can get the win. I really think that Ross Chastain could actually score his first career win. Like the top three all have not won in their careers yet. Which is crazy. This will be a this will be a very interesting restart because this could be like a first career winner. Oh, Daniel Suarez is ninth. Is Daniel Suarez actually ninth or tenth? Oh no, this could be detrimental. You never know. This could be like really detrimental. Here they come. Green flag. Three to go. Goes wait. Daniel Suarez is not tenth, isn't he? Oh, big moves for Daniel Suarez, but I. Um, um, this might be. Oh, go or go home, Ross. Go or go home. Come on, baby. Yeah, there's John. Oh, he's pointing. Yeah, but I really hope Daniel Suarez can, uh, no, 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 Eric Amarola. I think Chase Briscoe is going to win this race. Unless Ross Chastain pulls out the most aggressive move of his career, I think Chase Briscoe is going to win this race right here. Oh, no. Just imagine there's caution right here before the white flag. Chastain, I don't think he can get this. Oh, he might actually wreck. Ross Chastain. Let's hope uh, Ross Chastain gets second. Yeah, yeah, Chase Briscoe is going to win this race. Chase Briscoe is going to win this race, so um, Daniel Suarez is going to get eighth. This I think eighth. Yeah, Chase Briscoe wins in Phoenix. Great job, Chase. And Eric Amaro's top eight streak, top ten streak. Unfortunately, it's going to end. Aw, come on! That's terrible. Like, he's not in the he's not in the Winston Cup lead anymore. At least I think. Well, yeah, that's cool. I'm not gonna say dang it anymore. I could say it, but it, it's like too far away to say dang it. But Ross did a great job that last two laps. And wait, where's the? Okay, so um. 
40th start. But congrats from Eric yeah. Alvarola, whose consecutive top 10 and. streak ends today. Yeah. Great job, Chase. Great job, indeed. Well deserved. That's like the. Oh, is he gonna hit the wall? Oh, go back, go back. That could have been really bad if uh, Chase Briscoe hit the wall. That's why you don't burn out in Martinsville and NASCAR games. They don't want to hit the wall. I want a clean car, but that's really hard to burn out in Martinsville. Wait, is he with done with the burnout? Is he done? Aw, oh, come on, Chase. Give us a better burnout. No. Dang it, dude. I said dang it. Come on, man.